Hey, howdy, hey guys, how are you? So, hopefully you're doing well. I know it's been kind of cold, but um, Saturday I got to go outside and I was so happy. And there's like so many birds chirping and stuff. And I just went and sat in my backyard for a little bit. And it was really nice and have the sun. The wind was cold, but it was nice to be outside. So I hope you guys are taking some time to be outside because it's it's nice to get out and, and move about and stuff so um a couple things make sure if you have not taken the progressive area test that you do that i did put those scores on canvas um i have some late work that i need to get graded so i'll work on that and i also need to grade your guys' articles um the world war one articles from last week so i will be working on that today you're going to finish the world war one era notes um, oh, that's progressive area. Sorry. That's where the test stuff is just in case. Oh, and the test retake is available as well. So if you got a score on the test that you didn't like, you can retake it. Remember, please email me that you retook the test. So I know I need to go in and, and change it on camp on campus and on, on Skyward. Um, because I don't have that linked to Skyward because I don't want it to mess up everybody's test scores. So just email me, let me know, oh, I retook it. And then I know it's ready to go on to Skyward. All right, but if you haven't taken it at all, you want to make sure you use the test codes. And here's the quizzes to study for that. Okay, World War One, which is I hope you guys are having fun. Um, here's the without trench foot, with trench foot, um, and here's the note sheet. So again, just open up the note sheet, open up the near pod from where you left off, and um, go ahead and finish that up. Okay, and you should be so it should be questions ten through down here i'm um, gonna go to 16 and then there's this little journal entry uh, with a couple questions afterwards about um about what the war was like so hopefully you guys are getting um, a good understanding about that um also modules i put some more videos and somebody else emailed me a great video from time bomb which i had not heard before about guys and that's awesome so i'll put that up on there too if you're interested in learning more about world war one because again i get to teach you like this much about something that's so big it kills me okay oh, miss kirkman i'll be okay right okay um but there are so many cool things and again that's right here and it's not something that you have to do but if you um want some cool things um to look at or if you're really into virtual reality there's some really cool um things that you can do there Okay, also, last thing, if you have not um, signed up for our Vietnam War project, you want to make sure you do that today, because the end of today, we're going to be um, finalizing the project choices and be putting that up on campus um, later on this week sometime. It takes a little bit to go through all the choices and kind of uh, narrow it down and all, all that, all that chess. So make sure that you sign up. For the Vietnam Project, again, that's on the Hufflepuff, the Team Hufflepuff Canvas course. Um, also, just in case you guys don't know, the district has opened up Google Chat, um, and that's in Gmail. So if you go into your Gmail, your school, um, Jordan District account, um, so, so log into Gmail. Um, and then you can see that in Gmail, you have like your, on the left-hand side, you'll have your like your name and then a little plus sign so click on the plus sign and i'll have the space where you can enter a name email or phone and it, i just do name and so you just type a name if you want to chat with example me miss kirkman um you open up a chat box and you can send questions and here it would say it's a seventh student you put miss kirkman it'll say miss kirkman or rebecca kirkman um open a chat box and then you'll be there's a space down here where you can type in questions on um, videos or anything more to your teachers and you can do that with all your teachers so if you have questions and you're like i'm not sure what i'm supposed to be doing here this is a great place to do that um just realize that most teachers may only be online from eight to three p.m but once you send us a chat once we get into our email that'll open Okay, hopefully you guys are doing so great and keep keep doing a great job and you guys got this. So we'll see you out there.